Brian here with Help Sell My RV.com out of Louisville, Kentucky, where all RVs are for sale by owner. I'm about 20 minutes due east of downtown Louisville, Kentucky, out in Taylorsville, Kentucky, to do a walk around on this beautiful mint condition, only used once, 2024 Jayco North Point 382 FL RB, bath and a half, front living room, five slide, luxury, four seasons, fifth wheel. Uh, if you gave me the money and I had a choice to uh, certain campers in this class, this would be it. Uh, the floor plan, everything. Give it to me. I'll take it. Uh, this is beautiful. Uh, it does have the outside kitchen. This is pretty much fully loaded with the exception of uh, it does not have the generator, uh, but it does have the triple large 15,000 BTU AC units on the roof. It does have the 1800 watt inverter does have also uh, the full camera package. You have an entry door camera, two side cameras, and you have dual rear cameras, which I'll show you. Uh, and you have a monitor you can take inside and you basically use that system as a security system on it. Uh, there's a ton of other stuff. Let's go ahead and get started. Uh, overall exterior length. Uh, exterior length is gonna be 43 feet, 10 inches. Exterior height to the triple large 15,000 BTU AC units with heat pumps is gonna be right at 13 feet, four inches. And the unloaded vehicle weight, when it came off the assembly line, is gonna be right at 15,495 pounds. You will need a one ton truck. And the only reason why these owners are selling it, they've owned it six months and only used it once. Uh, they're just going in, down a different path. They're selling their house. So the whole property that this, uh, this whole pole barn sitting on, which is where this camper lives, since they've owned it, uh, uh, they're selling everything. So they gave me a call and I was uh, very excited to do this video because these things are awesome. Uh, first slide out's gonna accommodate the tri-fold sleeper sofa. Excellent condition, it's a cloth fabric finish and again showroom condition i would put this up against any brand new 2024 25 model all day long and the second slide is going to have the same thing stacy stewart collection badge and when these beds fold out they pretty much almost come together and you can sleep uh, comfortably to, uh, for adults in here easily or you can just cram a bunch of kiddos in here and in the back or front here you do have the theater seating with heat and massage usb charging port for each recliner nice led light accent up underneath and you do have 110 outlets on each side of the bit uh, the couch and that front windshield you've got a front shade it comes down right here you get the idea uh, MCD style roller blinds those are the ones you want oh you do have on your outlets you see the white sticker those are dedicated to the inverter so I almost forgot to point that out on your entertainment center package you do have the JBL sound system with subwoofer right there JBL sound bar there you do have the 40 inch or I'm sorry 50 inch uh, 4k TV on the front and you do have a 32 inch 4k TV on the back for the kitchen and this is on a televator and I'll show that here in a second and your fireplace is going to be about 4800 BTUs of heating so you can break off the chill in the morning or in the evening and if it gets colder you can turn on your 40,000 BTU furnace uh, which again it's four seasons so you can go into I think this is rated right at zero degrees you have these little Bluetooth pads here all over the place you can operate your lights and you got one here one in the kitchen one in the hallway you got them all over the place and you do have Jayco's voice activated command and I'll let's do this Jayco turn off all lights yeah Jayco turn on all lights Jayco turn off living room lights Jayco, turn on living room lights. You get the idea. And these are all the features you can do with Jayco's voice command. Pan right there for a second. It's pretty neat. Uh, your TV, I'm sorry, your uh, third slide out's gonna accommodate the uh, 
freestanding table and chairs and there's a leaf that pulls out right here you just lift this up pull that leaf out and you do have two collapsed uh, chairs somewhere around here but again excellent condition probably never sat in and you do have the power tower USB-C charging and USB charging and you do have a cell phone charger on top of the power tower okay this is going to be your fourth slide out uh, it's going to accommodate all residential GE appliances huge oven never been used and this is not your traditional RV cooktop nice residential four burner gas cooktop and you do have the quartz look countertop that might be solid quartz but you do have the uh, subway tile backsplash and these are real tiles and GE profile convection oven and it also convection microwave if you will does have air fry air fryer setting definitely neat oh spice rack there you go neat addition they've done and on your appliances underneath the oven which has never been used you've got a pretty decent little pots and pans drawer up underneath uh, stainless steel oh soft closing drawers it's way to go island kitchen and you do have the quartz countertop again uh, undermounted farmer style sink and you do have brushed nickel finish on your hardware this is going to be your uh, uh, fresh water spigot you have uh, spring water uh, you've got a container five gallon container I'll show you when we get outside that's dedicated to your drinking water spigot right there there's a little pump on the side here you can turn it on right there look at that 110 outlet right there and uh, your fresh water container that I was talking about is also uh, dedicated to your fresh water and your uh, ice dispenser right here. And the refrigerator is going to be a 20 cubic foot GE residential refrigerator. And again, you have an 18 watt inverter, which will be more than enough power when you're not hooked up to shore power. And when you're driving down the road, take care of your refrigerator that way. And let's back up here. Nice arch ceiling Jayco did. Nice arch beam right there. And it is a Magnum truss roof system, strongest in the industry. Uh, basically built your like your house. It's got trusses, uh, wood trusses just like your house. Uh, it is the strongest and it's in, in the industry. Uh, there was something I was gonna show you. Oh yeah, breaker box here, right there. In case you have a breaker trip and on your entertainment in the kitchen, you got a 32 inch 4K flat screen right there and there's your button for your televator put that down kind of give you an idea of what it looks like with it down uh, i love this floor plan uh, this would be the way that i would go be honest there you go it's the way to go 110 outlet up here you do have usb charging here they're all over the place another uh, keypad there or pad for the lighting and uh, you do a fantastic vent fan up there. They don't give those away. And eh, they might have given it away with this one. Uh, yeah, it's got a rain sensor. It's got the little blue umbrella. So it'll shut automatically. And there's your Max Air fantastic vent fan controls. And this is gonna be your half bath. And that is tall. Yeah, tall medicine cabinet you got a nice little fan up there and your whisper quiet AC units the quietest in the industry and that's because they scatter their returns that's the way to go when the AC's on it's it's the quietest so this is going to be your uh, 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 command center here basically it's if you've seen one you've seen them all the Bluetooth to your phone if you want or you can extend the awning and all turn on lights and uh, adjust thermostat and your levels but you can do all that with your phone another light pad there and your king bed and this is going to be your fifth slide out 
and it does have the plus mattress which I believe was an option and um, there's a satellite I'm one-handed yeah I'm one-handed there okay looks like your chairs fold up chairs and there's a satellite system down here that the owner says he's gonna give it away with the camper and it's a about a $500 setup for satellite but uh, kind of give you an idea of the headboard there and again you have the MCD style roller blinds in here too USB charging right there on each side of the bed another Bluetooth panel here and you can turn off all the lights if you want from here in the whole coach all the lights from that pad right there and just so I don't forget you've got a 110 outlet see a little white sticker and that's attached that's dedicated to your uh, 1800 watt inverter also nice barn door and that's going to be your third television Oh, yes, yeah, your security light switch. So you turn that on, bring in your monitor. It's a seven inch monitor that Jayco gives you, and you can bring it in here and set it right there if you want. And uh, you can keep monitor of your uh, outside with your camera package. Yeah, it's a beautiful floor plan. Bath and a half floor plan. That rear bath is just huge. Oh, foot flush porcelain toilet, also in the half bath. Wow. And again, arched ceiling. Fantastic vent fan. Yeah, there's no rain sensor on this one. Beautiful shower. It looks like tile. Uh, that's rated at 300 pounds from what I've been told. Glass enclosed. And this is uh, obviously it's a 50 amp service and this is washer dryer prepped. I love that they utilize magnets. I always say they should have done that a long time ago. There's your hook there. In case you want to put a stackable washer and dryer in here. Cabinets are some of the best. Uh, all solid wood cabinet, drawers, styles, everything. Uh, Jayco, they did an excellent job. The owner of this camper had a mobile suite, a 2023 mobile suite. He liked the construction on this better than a mobile suite. And I used to sell mobile suites, and that's saying a lot. That's a pretty bold statement. <laughs> but uh, I love Jayco's. For the money, yeah, that's the way to go. Barn door again. And you do have central vac. Uh, where is the central vac? There it is. <laughs> yeah, central vac right here. You can put a hose right there. And there's a pack, hose somewhere around here, a bag with hoses in them. Here's your little shoe caddy or whatever you want to do, locker. If you want to put shoes up underneath there, uh, doggy bowl, something, whatever. It's your option, your decision on that. Let's see what's in here. Okay, so again, magnets. So if you want shelving, you got shelving. And if you want to hang clothes or jackets, that's on a magnet too. You get the idea. There's a ton of stuff on this. Let's go outside. I might think of something. One last look. I love that beam. Just a residential look. Oh, and you do on your door, the window, there's an integrated uh, screen uh, uh, blind that's integrated in there. All right, you do have the more ride step above system on this, and you can, it's on a hydraulic strut, and you can uh, put that inside the door. Nice clean look going down the road. Nice addition, Jayco does with their handrail now. Uh, look at that, magnets. So you put this, I'm one-handed, but anyway, you take this. There you go. There, I'm one-handed, I just did that one-handed. There you go, and that's their handrail. Neat concept, uh, full-time, 
RV in warranty on this. Uh, it does have uh, on there a Magnum Trust roof system. It's a limited life warranty, lifetime warranty, but it's lifetime warranty. Most uh, other manufacturers, I believe they're a limited 12 year, but uh, all gel coat finish, uh, fiberglass, um, vacuum bonded walls, and of course, uh, four, in uh, four seasons insulation. You do have the dual 14 foot power awnings. Uh, that might have been an option. And again, you do have the camera package all throughout. And I'll show you the side view camera package. You do have the 17.5 uh, wheels and they're Union Royals. Not Goodyear's anymore. Uh, Union Royals, I love them. And they're H-rated. You do have tire monitoring on them. Uh, beautiful aluminum alloy wheels. The Dexter axles. Easy lube. Uh, never adjust brakes. Um, more ride. CRE 3000. Uh, suspension it's just a smoother ride going down the road and of course you do have the uh, six point auto level on this leveling jack system spare tire fully enclosed heated underbelly your holding paint tanks are all insulated slam latch baggage doors with magnets yeah gotta love it thumbs up on that and this is going to be your JBL Bluetooth hookup here, and you can do controls here or put it on your phone. Satellite hookup, internet, I'm sorry, satellite cable hookup, and there's all your aluminum framing all throughout. Rubber mat, probably gasoline resistant, maybe, I don't know. Uh, insulated slam latch baggage doors. <laughs> Gotta love them. Let's show off the kitchen. Kitchen, uh, the little two cubic foot refrigerator dorm fridge is. Um, connected to your 1800 watt inverter so it stays cold when you're going down the road which is cool 110 outlet there bottle opener there that jaco has been doing for a while uh, the sink is tied into your holding tank your gray tank which is i believe 82 gallons and your freshwater tank is 75 gallons and your black tank which is your toilet is going to be right at uh, i believe 74 gallons and this is going to be your griddle with the extension counter which is nice Looks like they used it the one time that they were out. Yeah. Let's see if we can fold this in one hand. Yeah, let me, I'm not going to do it one handed. You get the idea. Frameless windows. Gas assist, assist strut on the door. So that when the wind gets you, it, it won't get you. Outside shower, this is your spray port. Uh, awning package, full awning package on this. No, I'm sorry, it, it's got the, the porch awnings, but it does not have the slide out awning package. Uh, I'm 50-50 I'm on the slide out awnings. But if you're underneath a a tree or something uh, limbs can easily tear awnings that's the only thing I'm kind of weary about but 110 outlet cable satellite hookups here this is your uh, central back empty out here and you are uh, solar prepped on the ground here and up on the roof you're solar prepped there's your five gallon water bucket that's dedicated to your uh, fresh water spigot on the kitchen countertop uh, water dispenser and to your refrigerators uh, ice dispenser and water dispenser I'll show that on the back side motion activated lights let's turn that off oh 110 outlet here and you do have a little port here you can feed all your power wires through and you do have slam latch baggage doors yeah LED light accent up underneath you have three 40 pound LP tanks. That's what you want for something like this. Let's back up here, kind of show that off. Beautiful. Side cameras. All LED lights all throughout this camper, inside and out. More ride hitch box. Uh, it, it keeps that chucking, that banging when you're stopping and going. That more ride system is the best you can get for a pin box. You do have dual batteries. 
There's your hydraulic system reservoir and set up there. Kind of back up here. Uh, you do have light switches right here, and that's for your accent lighting right there. Forty pound LP tanks on the other side. You do have the tow assist, and this is tire monitoring system. Uh, again, you do have that. Oh, you do have analog brakes. I forgot to point that out. That's a big deal. Um, and uh, um, again, you have tire tire monitoring system and sway mitigation. So make sure you're riding true down the road. Yeah, motion detector. That's going to be your freshwater. Uh, bottle there you can go to Costco's or whatever get your spring water container five gallon container bring it in tie it into that there you go there's your 1800 watt inverter they don't give this stuff away that's that inverter was an option um, solar hookup right here you do have the ground solar and you do have a uh, solar prep up on the roof and this is going to be your water pump switch here kick that on kind of tells you the lights on or that it's on um, and uh, auto leveling if you don't know how to use that for your leveling jacks just follow the directions and outside shower for hot and cold water and follow this for winterizing oh looks like water pressure regulator here so you're all set up black tank sewer flush cleans out your toilet and whole house water filtration it's the way to go insulated slam latch baggage doors Again, rated right at zero degrees, uh, I believe maybe colder than that. That's your in tankless uh, water heater and that little switch on the inside, I think I showed it. There's a little switch right next to the TV up and down button and, it, and you can control the temperature. Uh, furnace exhaust right there. And that's your service panel for the back of the refrigerator. No big deal. Man, ton of stuff, I'm at 22 minutes. I'm trying to go fast. Uh, it's a little dirty, but uh, this coach will shine up like a brand new penny. Dump stations here. All your gate valves are all protected. Enclosed underbelly. And this is the huge garage storage up underneath. This is up underneath. If I can open it because I'm one-handed. There we go. There you go. Huge storage. This is going to be up underneath the bed. And this is going to be up underneath the bathroom. So this floor plan just has a humongous amount of storage. 15 amp power cord. There we go. You get the idea. It's the way to go. 300 pound uh, receiver on the back and uh, if you want to do that I don't know you're getting pretty long because this sucker is 44 feet long some states kind of restrict you on length that's the fifth camera that the owner has installed and that's for looking at I guess whatever he's got towing back behind this and then you have a backup camera ladder to get up on your full walk on roof and this is nice this pole barn's got this second story here. There you go. It's ready to go. 100% excellent condition. If you want to come and see the camper, call the number on the edge. You always deal directly with the owner, or you can call 502-645-3124. If you want to keep up to date on RVs coming for sale by owner, you can always follow Help Sell MyRV.com on Facebook, Twitter, and YouTube. Man, she's pretty. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up. There you go.